Okay, here's my 3030 lever action rifle. I keep this in my go bag and uh, um, emergency bag in a scabbard. And it's a lever action. It's a Marlin uh, Model 336, I believe. So it's a 3030 caliber, which is a 30 caliber. And originally they uh, named it that because they put 30 grains of ammunition, or I'm sorry, powder in the in the shell. And so Marlin called it a 3030, but uh, I believe Winchester originally came up with it. So I've got two of the shells here compared to a 223 or an AR-15 round, just to show you for comparison's sake. Um, the thing I like about it is it's pretty easy to operate. It holds six in this tube down here. You feed it in here and uh, holds one in the chamber, so seven total if you want to carry it like that. It doesn't have a safety per se, but that you'd be used to. But you see here, you've got the hammer all the way back, and then you just, you know, squeeze it to fire. And this is, you know, you don't want to carry it like this because this is actually resting against the firing pin. So what you do is you have a half cock position here. So it comes back just a little bit. And then it won't fire, um, and, and it won't uh, knock against the firing pin if you were to drop it or hit it with something. So you can pull it all the way back and then fire it. So of course in the cycle of the action like that, it, it uh, puts the hammer back for you. And it has um, iron sights, so it has a little elevator, as you can see it better this way, it has a little elevator here that you can slide back and forth to raise this up and down and then your typical front sights so I believe this is a 20 inch barrel and it weighs about seven pounds and the thing about the ammo which is pretty interesting is you know they used to be all blunted like this one on the left the reason is when you keep it in the tube they're end to end like this and the pointed cartridges would end up with the recoil striking the cartridge in front of it and you you get a, a fire inside the tube so they've blunted off the cartridges. Now the newer ones have a little polymer tip. You can see that. Which is kind of like a rubber-ish material which now you can get the ballistics of a pointed uh, bullet but then you don't have the risk of uh, that that uh, firing the, the round in front of you because you have now a little a cushion. So anyway, there's are two different rounds, and then for comparison, that's the AR-15. So anyway, hope you learned a little bit about it, and uh, leave some comments, and I'll show you my other guns in my gun gear playlist. Thanks.